Uh, one of my jobs here is to make sure that everybody in this room knows what a killer robot is by the time I leave. American Marines in Afghanistan had a, in a group of insurgents trapped in an alleyway and they were about to shoot them and one of them noticed that they were carrying a coffin. So what the Marines did was lowered their weapons, took off their helmets and, and let them pass. A robot would have just killed them all. There was no mercy there. Uh, the significance of uh, autonomous weapons uh, or killer robots uh, from a peace studies perspective is that it raises huge issues in terms of international law, both humanitarian law and human rights, uh, and also ethical issues in terms of human agency and decisions in the context of war. You have some sort of Al-Qaeda foot soldier, for instance, in a building, and you mark that, and it chooses, the, and it's next to a school. Um, it chooses the weapon, which will minimize collateral damage. But what happens is there was a thousand children in the school. If you choose the wrong weapon, you kill a thousand eight hundred children. You choose the right weapon, you only kill fifty of them. But the but the thing is, is that person? Well, not in my view, ever a person's worth that. But the the the, the military sort of uh, thing is, is that person worth fifty children? Is it just a foot soldier? No, we can't do that because the whole village will turn against us. Or whatever. That's something that a computer just cannot do. They have no reasoning powers whatsoever and it destroys. If these weapons are developed and deployed, then it destroys the very moral fabric of human society that has nurtured human values for over the years. So it has to be really dealt with. We cannot guarantee the predictability of these devices. We can't guarantee the reliability to perform the intended function, and we cannot guarantee their compliance with international law. AFRI works in the whole area of anti-militarization. Um, and particularly on the implications of militarisation in terms of diversion of resources from the alleviation of poverty and hunger and instead into the creation of, of weapons of warfare. So we will be definitely against killer robots. The idea of um, a robot deciding whether a human uh, lives or dies just is completely wrong.